my parts have come in. I pre-opened them, making sure they all, all there. So now I'll just take them off all their boxes and bag, and we'll start from there. There's all my parts together. This is the case. I heard good reviews on this, so I bought this. It's also cheap too. So fuck, so fuck yeah. Motherboard NVMe S SSD and not two drive. You got your RAM sticks, 16 gig graphics card. And these things are fucking hard to like, get get by one this time of time of year. This is the next best best option. So this is this is way better than that. So not really complaining about there. And then get your power supply, my hard drive. I think this is like a two terabyte. Ryzen 7. I was actually planning on getting a Ryzen 5, but for some reason the Ryzen 7 was more cheaper than the Ryzen 5. So I was like, fuck it. Upgrades. That and this were the most pricey parts to get. This is like 160, and that one's like 120. Uh, I think like, I think 70 for this one. 50. 60? 88. I already said you. And this was like 300 something. This was like another $300, so yeah. Add that up, I don't know how much that costs, but here it is right here. And yeah. Let's get started. Starting with you. And voila. So I'm, this is gonna be kind of hard. Oh, hey, how's it going, kitty? I'm gonna be doing this like one handed. And also I should point out, I don't know if I said this in the beginning, but this is my first time making a PC. So if you're trying to follow along, do not follow this video because I it will not end well for you. So keep, him, keep that in mind. Can you get the fuck out of here? Like, I don't, this is not a cat video. All right, let's open this thing and look what we got in here. Oh my God. I don't even see it yet. I've already looked through this already because I want to make sure the thing was like not broken. Like I looked on all of them, except for the power supply and, the, and this, and this, and this thing right here. Cause I didn't open this. I didn't open this either. I can, I can just see it through here. This I had, these two I didn't open, so yeah. Only certain things I open because I want to make sure they're like not broken. Look at that! Looks so cool. So exciting. What does it say? Play hard, stay silent. Zero frosting. You know. I wish my equipment was always silent. Actually, recently, this thing, I don't know if you guys have probably never noticed this. I also throw a string in Fortnite again. So, my PS4 had an overheating issue because I was taking to Gabe's house because I don't have any tools to clean clean my PS4 out. And uh, I needed like a little dusting because it's been a while. And after I came back, it overheated launching YouTube. So something was up. And then I figured out, I went to Gabe's house and tried to figure out what the problem is. And clutch for Gabe, because he stayed up like 30-ish hours trying to figure out the problem is. And all it needed was some thermal paste. And luckily I had some. This was just in case I don't have any for the computer. Because I, I feel like I might need this. But that, that stuff, the, the cooler in there, might have some pre-applied. But just in case, I have you. And then I'll put the sticker down here. So yeah. I We fixed my PS4, so. No more, over, no more loud ass fans. Which is dope. So these are like the three things I'm, I want to add on here. The, this is the SSD M.2, which goes like right here. And uh, this here, and then blah, 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 yeah, you know what it is. Also, yeah, the manual. Gonna need to know, uh, gonna need to know where to put the RAM sticks. I know it's probably like, probably like right here, skip one and then put it here. But just in case, don't look at it. So just give me one minute and I'll get back to you. Doom A2 and Doom B2. 
And that is where exactly? Is there a label? Oh, found it. That's kind of like hard to find. Okay, so it's this one and this one. I was right. Okay. So that's it. Dim A2 and Dim B2. Yeah, I don't have any like stand to put this on, so I'm gonna put it like that's not gonna help. Yeah, that works. It's not much, but I, whatever. Oh boy. That's the next thing. Something about holding like new stuff is like amazing for me. Alright, so this this goes the other way. Right there. Okay. So scary because that you think they're gonna flex or break and it's just I don't like that feeling. And uh you alright and this goes right here and uh wait 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 hold on where's that piece? Is there like a little ah oh, it's right here it's a little uh cover for it Team got the thermal pads on it too, in the little thing. Okay. I need this. And I need a screwdriver. I think I have one right here. This is the screw gave, that Gabe gave me. And there we go. All screwed in and installed. I think we're gonna put this on when the case was in the case. Cause like, it requires one of these things. Focus. It requires these things, and they have to be inserted here. Which there's no screw. There's nothing to screw onto here. It's just a little hole. So this, after we move the plastic piece off, which I'll do later, it'll have to be in the case. Cause uh. Actually, hold on. One second. So this, yeah, we have to go here. It'll look like that, basically. But yeah, that's just I don't have the risers right now, so this might be put aside for a bit. Just open the box. I don't know why it was, didn't record there. And what we have here is, oh, well, that's interesting. Is the uh, CPU on the side in the whole box, followed by this behemoth of a cooler. It also has a decent weight to it too. Now we can put this aside. I might keep those boxes because they look kind of cool. And today we have this and a loss. And now we are going to use this. Right here, and I believe this is like the little release thing. Yep. Okay. And also, this is very crucial, and I don't want to fuck up. So I'm watching a, a, a video on like how to set these up because I don't want to mess these things up. And yes, I'm fucking watching the tutorial. So fucking what? You have no idea how fucking scary this this feels right now. This is weird. <laughs> I'm just kidding. That kind of scared me too. All right. Yeah, the dude said don't 
touch the the golden contacts, duh. And don't touch the fucking silver side. Just the sides are okay, which is what the guy is saying. Holy fucking shit. That was the most terrifying part of this whole thing. Well, yeah, it's perfectly snug. It's locked in place. But holy fuck, dude. That is, that is scary. <laughs> I know, it's, just, it's the computer, but for me, that was fucking like a freaking horror movie times a million. All right, <laughs> on to the next part. Like, oh my god, this thing is heavy. Huh. <laughs> Where am I gonna install this? Hold on, I'm trying to figure out like, how does this thing install. Uh, hold on. All right, one second, guys. You know what I hate more than anything in the world? Is the fact that you have to forcefully force some pieces on here like this thing right here just to get it on and also at the same time you feel like you're just gonna break it that's the worst feeling in the world for me i just i don't like that it's a, it's a terrible feeling also this thing did come with pre-applied thermal paste so that's a plus on my end okay and i believe this is already it's pretty much all we can do to it right now. So I think the next best thing is you. <laughs> oh yeah, the IO, the IO shield. You gotta put this on first. So I'm just gonna quickly put that on over there. AKA like right here-ish, you know, make sure I put it on the right spot. And I think, yeah, that's the right spot actually. The right orientation to put it on to. Also, this is this little like wire the fan in a way. So yeah, this is this is actually a fucking dope ass case. The first case I ever bought and it's already looking sick. And I can't fucking wait to fucking play on this thing. Not just play on this thing, but also work on my thing on here. This is like ten times better than that piece of shit. I mean, it's great for what it is. But not grateful that I'm doing on it. it. Is in. Cool. All right. Brought out the bigger screwdriver because I feel like I need it. I'm trying to flip this where it's over here because you can do that on here. And I'm trying to figure out like how this works. I assume you just do this. This case comes with zip ties. That is sick. I also noticed it was right here too. And uh, I need the mounting cane, mounting screws for my motherboard. And I think they're in, yeah, they're somewhere in here. Hold on, but they're all in here. So I gotta look for that it's a rounded tip with a disc the ufo screws i'm gonna call them and that's what they look like right there oh, it's like a flip over right there that's what they that's what i'm looking for but before i do that i must put this in there so, let me just move these out of the way. And then, put you, I'm gonna use two hands because I'm not gonna be re recording at the same time, but I'm basically just gonna put this in here and you'll see why. You'll, you'll see in a second. I have just set it down in here. Now we just, we just gotta screw in these little screws in all of these corners and, and it'll be, it'll be completely installed. All right, let me just install that little riser piece. So now we're gonna remove remove this little plastic cover on here. What this does is like a little, it's like a little, uh, it's like a thermal paste. It's like a little heat sink. It makes the makes the M.2 run smoothly because it's running cool, like like this thing here. And everything everybody knows. Well, I'd hope everybody knows that 
Computer stuff runs better when it's cool. And the cover is on. All screws have been installed. It's looking good. All right, gonna need you. Ugh, this thing's pretty heavy too. God. All right. Okay. There's the power supply, and I guess this is the cables. Yep, there's the cables. Now, oh, what is this? Is this like a little pouch they gave me? Oh, dude, that is actually pretty sick. I need a little pouch. I can put my plugs in if I need to. That is sick. Put that up there just in case. Look at the fucking quality this thing is. It, it comes in its own Velcro casing. Like, what? Like, that is fucking sick. Don't know if I need to remove those, but we'll find out. I was going to say, this one's fully modular. You probably are already helping the plugs over there. Well, yeah, this is all the plugs I need. And I think I have it upside down. Yeah, I do. I have decided to just plug everything in. All right, just installed the, what do you call this thing, the power supply. And, uh... Yeah, I think that's off better be and uh yeah everything looks pretty snug i got all the plugs in because just so i don't have to like unscrew it plug them in just 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 to add some more stuff to it and uh it's not gonna really do anything it's just gonna just, like sit back there and when i need them i can just pull them out install what i need to install and then boom mission complete yeah, I'm gonna I'm gonna do this on I'm gonna do this like off camera because this is probably like the most boring part of all this little cable management and yeah I'll get to you when it's like all pretty much like no cables all, every all, all these will be plugged in well not everything I think this one is the graphics card which will not be plugged in because uh I'll be showing case in that in a bit and that's that runs I need you you're the Hard drive that I need. Hi, cat. You spooky son of a bitch. All right. I'll see you guys right about. Alrighty. I just I just plugged in all the uh, the fans, all the small cables. Not the, not these ones yet. But now, since I'm since I'm gonna use going to get the hard drive, I'm gonna show you show you show you which one I got. I believe it's a two terabyte, two terabyte Baruku Seagate Baruku or this is two terabyte. That's all you need to know. And I'm gonna put it in there. You just, I just put it in the wrong one, didn't I? Actually, hold on. Aha! See, I'm smart. And on the bottom one. So now I just gotta turn it over and plug them in. <laughs> okay, now that we're kind of ready for the graphics card, and I should probably. Oh, these are already pushed down. Okay, just making sure nothing, this thing is like pushed down. But uh, yeah, still doing cable management, but I'm just getting like all the power things in here, the power cords and all that. This look kind of looks tacky, but it looks decent. I don't really mind. Here we go. This is my little card that I'll be using for my computer. And uh, if you want to know which one this is, it's the one I can afford and get, actually. And it's the Radeon R RX 5600 XT. It's the only one they have in stock because everything else I was looking at was like beyond overpriced and also out of stock and this is the one that i just found that it should perform pretty well i mean pretty much anything would be better than that all right time for the installation i need two hands so i'm gonna have to like uh, you know I'll, I'll see when it's, in, when it's in, installed and there and there we go perfect it's actually looking pretty sick now, do you see what I mean by this this uh, 
this case cheats because well for one these switch ties worked pretty well as the zip ties so i just like fuck it i'll use these and uh yeah these big ass cables are like hard to tie down and i didn't tie them down at all actually i just shoved them away all behind this fucking shield and just tied them together probably not the best thing to do but there's no way these cables are like, going to be tied down they're like so big and just they just stick out and there's yeah there's like no no real no real way to like secure them properly i mean it's kind of hard so just like fuck it put the chain hey, down here and we're called a day and boom we're done also it's that time that i've been waiting for the tempered glass the moment i've been waiting for That is so fun. Not only that, I could do it four times. <laughs> That's the best part. Put this, close this, and there's that side. Yeah, there's two doors. Can you believe that? There's one right here too. Here we go. Oh my God. It's so satisfying doing that though. Oh, we forgot one. <laughs> Fucking sick. <laughs> so yeah, it, I got to do that four times. Can you believe that? Crazy, huh? Well, yeah, that helped. Huh. That was the first time I got shocks today. Static electricity, holy shit. I never get those here, that is crazy. Static electricity. Good thing didn't happen while I was in there. Okay. Yeah, never had that once till now. All fans are working. That one's working, that one's working. Is, it, is that one working? Hold on. Oh, that one's not working. Oh, that's why. Hold on. There we go. Now it's working. Okay. And obviously you're working. And you're working. So yeah, it looks like everything is working. And yeah, what I do just now. I'm just downloading the Windows Media Tool, the Install Tool, and. Go on now, go f get a, what do you call that thing? Activation key. I'm gonna go, I'm gonna go get one of those. And this thing works though. And I'm fucking proud of it, first try, fuck yeah. Also, I'm just waiting for it to download so I can put it on there. It's, it's, on my, it's going on my flash drive right now. So yeah, I need that. Hey, what's up guys? Uh, Johnny from the present day, and uh, I forgot to fucking record the me installing the Windows 10 on the computer. Everything is working, all the fans are working, the CPU is working, um, both the drives are showing up and they're, and they're working too, so I have tons of space. Five times the regular amount that I had on my other computer. But this is like a huge upgrade for me, so now I'm, I'm pretty pretty proud that I, did, I had no problems at all. It's running quiet as hell. I can barely even hear it sometimes. That's how quiet it is. And uh, also, I think it's time to uh, get a desk, because uh, I have no desk here. I'm just... I have a little fucking little side table. Well, yeah. Thanks for watching, and... uh. So like and subscribe if you enjoy and if you don't like it and dislike that and you know i don't care and uh i'll see you guys in the next one peace out